Hey guys, Casey Foster here from NetcodeGuys.com doing a headset review this time. I was going to say demo review because I've been doing a lot of demo reviews lately, um, but this is actually a headset review for a company called Kenevo. Um, they're a relatively unknown company to the gaming space. Um, they mostly make Bluetooth audio equipment. I'm reviewing their uh, Bluetooth headphones, um, which is actually called the Urban's URBN. This is their Candy Apple Red model. Uh, they have like two different colors, like uh, three different colors, red, gray, black, I think. Um, anyway, they sent me these to review and I told them I would give them an unbiased uh, opinion um, about their equipment. And they said, sure. So I obviously have been using gaming equipment for a really long time. Um, you know, everything's always plugged in. So this is, I've actually, I've actually had Bluetooth headphones in the past, but I kind of tossed them because they were just like little in-ear ones and they didn't work too well. But these are over the ears, um, really, really squishy, soft uh, material here for the ear pads. Um, been using them new now for about two weeks. I've uh, been trying to use them a lot actually in the mornings when I go to bed, I'll listen to some music or whatever. Um, and um, they've actually been working out really great. So it's obviously Bluetooth. And the way that I have it set up is I have a laptop like right here, actually you can't see it off screen. Um, and it just has like Pandora um, playing or paused all the time. And I have these headphones connected to the computer. And then this is a three story townhouse in my bedroom upstairs and my office is downstairs. So I actually just have these connected at all times. Um, it's actually really sweet the way that it connects. You just simply switch the switch on and instantly it connects to Bluetooth. It does the same thing on your phone. Um, as long as your device is always turned on for uh, Bluetooth, your laptop, or your phone, whatever it may be. So I'll just, I just wear the headphones around and simply use the audio controls on them. Uh, I got an audio control, got an on off switch and a pause and play and next and repeat or uh, previous song on the actual um, headphone, headphone controls here. So then I just carry these around with me. I take them upstairs, I take them downstairs and um, I actually don't have to bring anything with me. I could connect it to my phone, but then I like to like, you know, browse the internet and stuff on my phone. So um, don't want it to mess with the music I'm playing with. But anyway, um, I, like I said, I've been using them now for about two weeks and I am, I'm not gonna lie, I was a bit skeptical about them at first, you know, I was like, oh, you know, I've never heard of the brand. You know, they're, they're relatively uh, lightweight for a Bluetooth headphone. Usually they're a little heavier because they have a battery in them and a controller board, things like that. And I was like, eh. But I was like, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it two weeks. I'm gonna try them out and I'm gonna give them an unbiased opinion. And I like, by the end of the two weeks now, I am pretty damn surprised at the quality, um, the audio, um, the audio quality as well, as well as the build quality. Like, you know, all headphones kind of make a little squeaky-ish or sound when they're plastic really comfortable it's got a foam pad on the top like i said foam pads on the ear pads um and that's like i said overall you know for the price point that they're at they're 100 bucks uh, 99 dollars um, i'm really surprised at the quality of these things and um i i've like i said i've not had many other bluetooth headphones to compare it against but i've had bluetooth earbuds and i've had headphones you know now forever um and they're really damn comfortable the audio quality is pretty damn good over bluetooth um, it's got NFC, uh, near field communication. So if you have an NFC device or NFC enabled, NFC enabled device, you just touch it for automatic pairing. If not, you just hit the button connects on Bluetooth. Um, comes with a carrying case, you know, it's, it's, it's hard. So you can put your headphones in there. It doesn't break. It comes with a USB charger and then obviously a standard auxiliary plug to plug it in wired. If you didn't want to use Bluetooth, um, with that, like I said, I'm with that said, I'm pretty impressed with the headphones. Um, you know, for a hundred bucks, you just can't beat it. You know, I've, I charged it for an hour. Um, it still has full battery. I, I connect it to my phone, which I'll do right here. And I'll show you guys real quick. I'm gonna turn on Bluetooth. And um, so you can see here, let me uh, unlock this. So you can see that it's, Bluetooth enabled and then you can see that it's not connected. I don't know if it will come in focus and I'm going to flip the switch and then it connects automatically. I actually just heard it there and then boom, it's instantaneously connected. Let me come out a little bit. You can see the little battery icon. It's actually still got full battery, full battery. I've been using it now for two weeks in the mornings, during the daytime, you know, probably two hours a day. 
Still, that's amazing. Still has full battery. Oh, it's actually like 98% battery. Um, connected automatically, you know, you can start listening to, you know, music instantly. I, I love the fact that you don't have to pair it each time you want to connect, uh, each time you want to listen to music or have to click the button to connect it. I, I really like that. So as soon as I flipped it on, it connected to Bluetooth. Um, really impressed by that. So um, yeah, I would give these headphones a solid like eight and a half over 10 out of 10, um, eight, eight, eight out of 10. The only thing that I would do a little bit better on them, um, this is me personally. I like headphones that go around my ears. Obviously they're lightweight Bluetooth headphones, you know, they're meant to be traveled with. Earphones that go around your, or headsets that go around your ears are generally gonna be a little bit bigger, but you know, that's really the only gripe that I have is I wish they did go over your ears, um, but that's just because my personal preference. Some people like them on their ears like this, some people don't, but that would be really the only difference. And um, the, the next thing is I just like to listen to music a little louder and they go, it goes pretty loud, but not mega loud. Um, but yeah, pretty damn good solid headphones, 99 bucks. Um, actually for this review, they gave me a coupon code. It's URBN2015. I'll put it in the description. I'll put a link to these on Amazon as well. You guys can check them out if you'd like, but the actual coupon code is for 30 bucks off. So you get them for $70. You know, and if you have Amazon prime, it's free shipping. So pretty damn good, good deal. Um, yeah, overall, very, very surprised and I, I'm going to be more open to uh, other types of hardware and equipment than what I'm used to uh, have been, than, than what I'm used to have been using over the years. So, yeah, check them out, guys. Canovo, um, you know, if you if you go buy them, you know, definitely drop them a review on Amazon. You know, everybody likes good reviews and a, you know unbiased reviews. So, speaking of the uh, Amazon reviews, I went ahead and checked out the reviews that they have on Amazon um, and reviews on their website. The one thing that Canovo likes to uh, brand themselves or express or brag about themselves is they have good customer support. And like based on what I've been reading, they have like amazing customer support, like phone, Twitter, email, uh, like a form support. They have like all kinds of different support forums and they're actually really, really, really responsive. Um, and they have a great warranty and you know, if you, something breaks or you break them or whatever, they'll work with you and get it sorted out. So. Um, that was one thing I was really surprised about is generally speaking these newer companies, you know, they're not real good about that But you know in this day and age of products people want, you know Good things and if you're gonna pay like decent money for stuff, you know, you're gonna want a good product and you're gonna want the company to back it so uh, Really impressed with that. Yeah guys uh, check them out and uh, this is Casey Foster signing out. Thanks